Hey everyone, it's John Lang. Man, today has been one stressful ass day. I am not gonna lie. I've been trying every, I've, uh, I use Customer Factor for my CRM software and I cannot figure it out. There's just something going on with it and it's driving me insane. So, submitted an email to them and I've called and left a message. Hopefully they can walk me through some of this stuff, but it's totally messing up with my scheduling. I'm not getting notified when customers are accepting estimates, and that's a huge, huge problem. <sighs> so, on the positive side, I am going to be doing a house washing job tomorrow and washing a deck, cleaning the deck up a little bit. So, I'll, be I'll, I'll make sure to film that and show you guys how, to, how I do that from start to finish. I just want to make a quick video of the day. I don't know if it's going to be that valuable to anyone. I don't know if, you know, but it should because there was a point in time where I didn't know how to make a house wash mix. And I, I the way I learned is I experimented, honestly. Um, so as long as you have your downstream injector working properly, this is the mix that you will want to use. Um, if you can't get your downstream injector working properly due to the length of hose you have or something, you can always go with an X-Jet and you can play around with play around with that. And I, I used an X-Jet for the majority of my season last year. Totally worked, but definitely be careful uh, carrying around a bucket full of house wash mix because if you spill it, you'll kill that whole spot in their yard where you spilled it and you'll have to replace that section of yard. Um, can get expensive not too expensive if you know you just buy a lawn repair kit and do it yourself but to say the least you don't want to do that um, so I prefer to downstream for exactly that reason when things you'll need to downstream a house with a house wash mix that's effective is sodium hydrochloride also known as bleach 12.5% that's the good stuff. You'll want to find this. Anything less, I can't help you because I don't work with that stuff, so I don't know the proper mix to make that. You'll want to buy Eliminator. This is at PressureTech.com. It's like 22 bucks a gallon. Totally worth it. It actually makes your bleach stronger, your, your sodium hydrochloride stronger, lasts longer, uh, and it can match the scent of bleach you know, homeowners don't like the scent of bleach all over their house. It's a turn off, honestly. So if it smells like pine saw, it makes everyone happy. A five gallon pail is perfect. You'll probably go through one of these per house wash. So you can just make your mix per job and it works out great, especially for a small time guys starting off because you're not gonna have jobs booked back to back all day. And if you make a big mix, it'll start to spoil. Not spoil, but uh, the potency will will cut cut down. It won't be as potent and you'll waste it. If you make it per mix, you're perfect. You can use it right there at the job and then maybe get a job a couple days later, make the mix right at the job, use it up, and you're good to go. Um, so, it's real simple. Two gallons of water. You know, a lot of times I'll just use an empty one of these or an empty you know, windshield washer fluid container, they're both the same. So two gallons of water, one gallon of the sodium hydrochloride, and three ounces, three to five ounces of Eliminator. Honestly, three ounces is plenty. And you wanna kinda of do it in that order, honestly. If you put the Eliminator in first and then all that stuff, it'll start, you know, I guess unless you pour it real slow, but it'll start, suds it up and you'll get a bunch of bubbles so add the eliminator last um do not use dawn dish soap that dawn dish soap actually does not is not supposed to be mixed with bleach it has adverse effects and can give a, a poor quality house wash i don't know why a lot of guys do that um, i tried it and i was being left with streaks not streaks but splotchiness and it just wasn't not a good mix don't ever use dawn I switched to this Eliminator and made my job a whole lot easier. So, um, yeah.
think I'm gonna leave on that. Like I said, I had a stressful day. Um, I just try to try to squeeze this video in there. I promise you that tomorrow will be a lot better video. I'm gonna film a job and uh, it'll be exciting. Thanks for watching. Take care.